Hi my beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another tag video. Um, I'll probably do a lot of tag videos up until I can get my challenges up and running. I'm hoping to be able to do that here in the next week or so. Um, this one is going to be the 100 questions that nobody asks tag. And I'm going to try and do this all in one shot, but if not, then I will split it up. If it gets too long, I'll split it up into two different videos. So the first question is, do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? Um, I don't know if you guys can see in the background, that's my closet, and it's partially open. So and that's how I've been sleeping with it for the past, I don't know, I don't know how long it's been open actually. So depending on what I do, I guess, I, I do both. Number two, do you take the shampoos and conditioner bottles from hotels? No. I usually leave them there because I usually have my own stuff. So I don't, I don't usually go to a hotel though. I've only been to a hotel like three times in my whole life. Uh, do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out? Uh, on the sides they're out, but on the bottom of the bed they're tucked in and under so that they stay. Um, just because I have an air mattress and they don't, they tend to not stay, so I'll just tuck it in on the very bottom of the bed. Um. Number four, have you ever stolen a street sign before? No? Never had to? Never? I uh, no. Uh, number five, do you like to use post-it notes? I haven't used a post-it note in a long time. So I, I, I like to write on things, but I, like I said, never used a po haven't used a post-it note in a long time. Number six, do you, <clears throat> sorry, do you cut out coupons but then never use them? Yeah, I do. I, I'll find a coupon that I really, really want to use, and then I never get to use it because I don't go to town very often. So it always expires before I can use it. Number seven, would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees? Considering I have a huge, like, major fear of bees, I would choose the big bear. Number eight, do you have freckles? Yes, I have freckles in the summertime, usually. Um, they're all over my face. I don't know if you can see the camera, probably not. But they're like all like right here usually, or down my nose. Um, that's usually where I get them in the summertime. In the wintertime, they kind of fade away a little bit. Uh, number nine, do you always smile for pictures? You, I, I try to, unless I'm being really silly, then I'll just kind of have a straight face like, you know. But... I usually smile. Number 10, what is your biggest pet peeve? Um, it really bugs me when people eat with their mouth open, like when they chew with their mouth open. Oh my gosh, I hate that sound so much. So much. And when people like scratch those like holographic things, those like cards like that have the little ridges and they're holographic. Oh my gosh, that noise. That noise. It just bothers me so much. Number 11, do you ever count your steps when you walk? I don't walk, so no, but I don't even, I don't even count my pushes when I push my wheelchair. I don't know why you would count your steps unless you absolutely need to, like you're finding treasure or something, but I don't count my steps. Have you ever went to the bathroom in the woods? That's number 12 and 13. They're kind of, they're combined. And no, I have not. Number 14, do you ever dance if even if there's no music playing? Yeah. There's usually music going on in my head and I will dance be just because I'm bored or because I'm happy or because, just because. And, or my nephew asks me to dance or, you know, wants me to dance with him and so I'll just dance. I don't care. I like dancing. Um... Number 15, do you chew your pens and pencils? Pens, yes, the caps of them, like if they're on the, the bottom of the pens, and I, if I'm like nervous or if I'm bored, I'll chew on the cap. But pencils, no, that, that I don't like the taste. It's gross. Pencils are gross. How many people have you slept with this week? Um, well, there's two answers to that. Zero. And people... There's five people in the house, so and if you count, you know, sleeping, there's five people, so I guess. But 
it'd be zero. Uh, what size is your bed? I want to say full size. I'm not sure. Maybe twin. I don't know. Uh, it's an air mattress, so I don't know. It's enough for me. It's big enough for me. How about that? Um, what is your song of the week? The song I am currently like in love with right now. Actually, I heard it the other day, and I kind of have it in my head lately. Is the colors of the wind from the movie *Pocahontas*? I kind of really like that um, that movie, and I like the song, so I've kind of had it in my head a little bit. That and um, I think it's *A Thousand Years* by um, Christina Perry. My sister had us walk down the aisle to that to that song at her wedding, and ever since her wedding, I had it stuck in my head. So that those are the two songs of the week of this, you know, recently that I've had kind of stuck in my head and listened to. Uh, number nineteen: Is it okay for guys to wear pink? Yeah, you, guys can wear any color they want to, just like girls. You can. Be your own person, do your own thing, wear whatever you want, and don't let anyone tell you any different. Number 20, do you still watch cartoons? Yeah, I do, I admit. I watch, like, Sponge, I'll catch myself watching Spongebob, or if I get really in the mood to watch a cartoon, I'll watch, like, the older ones, like, Rugrats and stuff like that that I grew up with. So I start, I was actually watching Rugrats, like, two weeks ago or so. It was on the TV that the movie was on. So yeah, I was watching Rugrats. Um, but I also watch adult um, cartoons like Family Guy and American Dad and all that. So, But yeah, I, I like cartoons. They're fun. Uh, 21. What's your least favorite movie? Huh. That's a good question. I've, I've never really thought of my least favorite movie of all time. I kind of I like watching movies. So... I, I don't know. I don't really have a least favorite movie. Number 22, where would you bury hidden treasure if you had some? Somewhere close and somewhere that I can remember that I had it in case I want to use it or in case that I need to find it. Somewhere close, maybe in my yard somewhere. I, either that or like in a wooded area that I know of that I can remember where it's at. Uh, 23, what do you drink with dinner? Um, depending on what we have here in the house, usually, like tonight, it was tea. It was sweet tea. Um, with Splenda. Not, like, it's with no calorie tea. Uh, cause I'm, I, I do calorie counting. So, it was a no calorie tea. But, sometimes it'll be water, or like a sparkling water that I drink. Or, juice. Or milk. Um, it hasn't been pop in a long time, so I haven't drank any pop in a while. So, um, yeah, it's usually tea or sparkling waters that I drink. Um, 24. What do you dip a chicken nugget in? Uh, dip, it all depends on what I have at the time, but if I really had the choice, it would be honey. I love honey on my chicken nuggets. Oh my gosh. I haven't had, been able to have honey on my chicken nuggets in a while, but yeah. Uh, 25. What is your favorite food? Um, probably, probably tacos or nachos because I love Mexican food and tacos are just, oh my gosh, they're so good. Yeah, I haven't had tacos in a while, so maybe I'll have to have that for dinner sometime here soon. Uh, what movies would you watch over and over and still love? Oh. Lion King, I love that movie. I'm actually getting a tattoo of Lion King. I could watch that movie over and over. I have watched it over and over since I was like three, and I still love it. Um, Breakfast Club, I love that movie. I could watch that over and over again until you know the DVD was worn out. Um, any parts of the Caribbean movies, I love those movies. I love The Heat with Sandra Bullock and Melissa McCarthy. Oh my gosh. I actually watched that this morning and that was, I love that movie. I could watch it and still find it so funny. I love Melissa McCarthy. She's so funny. Um, 
Last person you kissed or kissed you. I kissed my nephew on the forehead today because he said he loved me, so I kissed him on the forehead. That counts. Uh, where were you ever a boy or Girl Scout? I was up until I was, I want to say, 16 maybe. I don't know. I was the green, whatever the green is. So that's when I stopped. The green sash. That's when I stopped. Um, but yes, I was a Girl Scout at one time. Uh, would you ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? No. No need to put yourself out there like that. You know, have a little bit of modesty. A little bit. <laughs> uh, number 30. When was the last time you wrote a letter to someone on paper? Probably back in high school. My friends and I used to write notes in class and then in the hallway we would like give it to each other and then we'd read it in, in the another class and then write back on that same note or on a different note paper so yeah probably in high school like 11th or 12th grade um can you change the oil on a car no i can't i have to learn sometime i don't drive a car so i don't know how to change an oil change the oil I should say ever gotten a speeding ticket not in a car, but I've always been told in my wheelchair to slow down. I'm always told to slow down. I don't know why. <laughs> I like going fast in my wheelchair. Um, number 33, ever ran out of gas? Like I said, I don't drive, so no. Um, I've run out of energy, so if that counts, then yeah. But not actual, in a car, gas. No, I've never run out of gas. Uh, favorite kind of sandwich? I was actually just talking about this to my, with my brother the other day. I have been craving a peanut butter and pickle sandwich for so long now. Oh my gosh. But if I had to choose a favorite sandwich, it would probably, I know it sounds so gross, but I grew up with it. It's peanut butter, cheese, and mustard. I, I know it sounds so gross, but I'm telling you, just try it. It's so good. It's so good. Uh, best thing to eat for breakfast. In my opinion, if I could have it every single day, it would be French toast with sausage links and hash browns. Yes, I love French toast. I get it. If I go to a place that serves breakfast all day long, that's what I order. Usually it's French toast with sausage. Because I love French toast. What is your usual bedtime? Whenever my eyes close for the two hours that I sleep a night, pretty much. I sleep like an hour on and an hour off. You know, I sleep on and off through the night. So whenever my eyes decide to close that night, that's usually it's usually around eleven ish, eleven thirty ish if I'm lucky. Um, are you lazy? On certain days, I have my days where I'm lazy. I honestly do. And like today, today was definitely one of those lazy days. Where I just did not want to do. I didn't even want to get out of bed this morning. I was just felt so lazy. I didn't sleep really. So yeah, I have my days where I'm lazy. When you were a kid, what did you dress up as for Halloween? Um, I dressed up as a lot of things for Halloween. I mean, I dressed up something every you know something different every year. So I've been a lot of things. I remember I was Gretchen Wilson one year, the country singer. Um, I was a, I made up a costume. It was like a blue mask with a blue shirt and I had blue eyeshadow on. I was something blue. I, I don't know what I was, but I was just this masked person. I um, can't remember. I was a witch one year. I was, gosh, I don't remember. I can barely remember what I had for breakfast this morning, let alone my childhood. <laughs> um, what is your Chinese astrological sign? I don't know actually. Let me... I don't... I don't remember ever knowing what my astrological sign for the Chinese actually was. I know I'm a Gemini um, for like the regular astronomical astrological signs. I'm a Gemini, but um, 
I want to say I remember reading that I was it was horse maybe I don't know honestly I don't I don't remember I would look it up but um I'll put it in the description below if you're really interested in what I am um how many languages can you speak I speak English I speak a little very very little bit of Spanish and sarcasm I I say that is a language so I speak that very fluently do you have any magazine subscriptions not anymore I used to be subscribed to the WWE wrestling magazine but I I kind of let that one expire because they just got too much money so um yeah I, I used to be which are better Legos or Lincoln logs I like Legos they're fun <laughs> They're fun to build stuff with. Are you stubborn? I can be stubborn. I can be very stubborn at times. Depending on what you want me to do, I can be very, very stubborn. Who is better, Leno or Letterman? I don't like, I don't watch either of them. Ever watch soap operas? I used to with my grandma when I went over there, my great grandma, um, before we, she went to the nursing home, but um, I used to whenever I would go over when I was little. Are you afraid of heights? Yes. Do you sing in the car? Yes. I do. Do you sing in the shower? No, not really. Not usually. Do you dance in the car? Depending on the song? Yes. And then I'm going to stop at number 50 because my battery is going to die on my computer. But um, number 50 is ever used a gun. When I was younger, my dad taught us how to shoot a gun so yeah I've used a gun once and I haven't used it since but that's okay I'm not really a hunter or anything I don't do fish but not hunt so um that was the first 50 of this 100 question thing so I am going to record the the last one our last 50 um with a, bo a bonus question too, so it's about like 51 of them. But um, I will record that and I'll have that up next week for you guys. And then hopefully I will have the baby food challenge that I want to do up. Either that or it will be the bean boozled challenge. I got my brother to agree to come on camera with me and do the bean boozled challenge with me. So either it will be the baby food challenge or the bean boozled, whichever one comes first. I'm not sure yet. Um, if you have any other tags or challenges you want me to do, or like first impressions or anything like that on this silly Saturdays, let me know in the comments below. Or any any videos you want to see on this channel, just give me you know, a comment, and I will do my best to get that up for you. Or leave any questions that you want to ask me for my Friday vi videos, just leave them in the comments below, and I will answer them and I will do that for you in the next video. So don't forget to subscribe if you already aren't. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up or a double thumbs up, whatever. And share it on your Twitter and your Facebook and Tumblr and whatever other sites there are out there. And yeah, so just don't forget that you are beautiful just the way you are. And I love you and I will see you in the next video. Bye.